Hey, what's up guys? It's Chandler Cardi here, and today I'm doing another Llama Arts reaction video. Just about, like, um, I believe 15 hours ago, which was, like, yesterday. Um, Llama Arts uploaded a new horror story animated. It's called We're Watching You Animated. This is going to be pretty creepy, because I haven't seen this before, and uh, I wasn't, like, I was planning on doing this reaction, but not, you know, I didn't plan on doing it sooner, because, uh, I did other things on my phone. I did other things on my phone. Sorry if my voice kind of sounds weird, but, yeah, it's very early in the morning, as you can tell. Um, you know, it's 5.30 a.m., you know, where I'm at, living in Illinois. You know, out here in the Midwest, time zone completely different. Like, probably about, I don't know, an hour earlier from the East Coast and two hours ahead of the West Coast. Pretty funny. Um, you know, well, not funny like that, but, you know, because you know the time zone's different, you know? Meaning, you know, funny how the time time is different. Wh whatever. You guys are probably getting, and I'm not saying funny like that, but you pro guys are probably going to know where I'm getting at. So, yeah, 5.30 out here in uh, Illinois. Um, I would say it would be 3.30, actually 3.31, on the West Coast, and I'm pretty sure you guys on the East Coast might be an hour ahead. I don't know if you guys really are or not, to be totally honest with you, but... You know, pretty sure all the time zones all around the United States are different. You know, depends on what region you're in, what part of the country you're in, you know. You know, well, it depends on where you're at in the United States and in the area that you're at, you know, with the time zone being different in certain places, you know. Because I lived in California before for like three years. And I ended up moving back here to Illinois. Um, now it's 12. Because I moved to California when I was 9. And came back out here when I was 12. So. Let's just say that it's 7.30 p.m. In California it would be 5.30 so, uh, yeah, well, let's just get into the reaction. That was just, you know, t very early in the morning right now. But who cares? I'm still making this reaction. I don't give a damn. Let's get to it. This video is sponsored by Raycon. More details at the end of the video. <sighs>
calls me on my birthday, so this is, I guess, what you decided to do instead. Listen, guys, I've, I've played enough Silent Hill, okay? This is nothing. We're watching you. What the hell? You like to be seen. watching TikTok compilations instead of sleeping. The everyday E25 earbuds last six hours between charging. It can be charged in the carrying case, giving a total of 24 hours of playback, so you never need to worry about battery life while out and about. You get a range of tips to ensure you get the perfect fit for comfort and noise isolation. They are available in black, blue, rose gold, white, and red, so you can choose a color that suits hey, you. My color, red. It's easy to see why Raycons are loved by celebrities like Snoop Dogg and Cardi B. The best part about Raycon earbuds is that they start at about half of the price of other premium wireless earbuds. If you would like a pair of premium wireless earbuds with tons of bass, go to buyraycon.com slash llama arts for 15% off or click the link in the description. <laughs> Shut up and take the money. Thank you for sticking around to the end of the video. If you would like to support the channel, check out the merch link in the video description. Skip the ad. Okay, well... That video was pretty, it was pretty unknown. You know, what, not unknown, what, what the fuck am I saying? That video was pretty short and, you know, kind of, uh, I don't know. I don't know why I said unknown, but, you know, the end, the fucking creepy guy with the bandage mouth just got shot, the fucking desert eagle. But, uh, I wonder for Lava Arch's next video, they might make a horror story about, I don't know, shootings maybe, shootouts, I don't know. To have anything with do, to have anything to do with a weapon, um, what if he would, uh, have a story about, like, a horror story, like, about, I don't know, shootouts, like, Shooting scenes like drive-bys, 
Something like that. What if he can make a horror story like that? You know. You know, it would be pretty cool if he'd do something like that, but I don't know if he would do that, because uh, he's probably got a whole lot of other stuff on his mind. So, so I mean, but this horror story was uh, pretty good. I mean, it was a short one, but... <laughs> You know, I kind of don't get it with the fucking creepy ass people though. You know, telling them that they're they're watching them. Apparently, this guy likes to be watched. That that's one thing I don't get. Um, kind of creeped me out this entire fucking video, especially that bald guy with the bandaged mouth. Basically, he got shot in the head. I'm pretty sure at the end of the video, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this short reaction video and uh yeah be seeing you guys next time later peace